Hi guys, welcome back to the Pixar YouTube channel. My name is Olivia. I'm a content creator for Pixar. And today I'm going to be showing you guys how to color grade your videos using Pixar. As a film student, I will say all these methods are super easy. They make your videos look professional, so cute, and hot girls don't gatekeep, so I'm going to hook you guys up with this. The first example I'm going to show you guys is on a raw Digicam video that I took. Obviously, you can see the original video is very flat. There's no color, no life to it. We're going to fix that. The first thing you can do is quite simple. You can just go into effects and slap on any filter you want. What we can do to make this video a little bit less flat and add some more color is add a saturation filter on top, which is going to brighten it up and add more life to it. Another thing you can do is add film filters, which if you've seen my past videos, you know how much I'm obsessed with the film filter trend going on. We have a bunch of really cute film filters that you can use to have that little vintage effect. Some of my favorites are film three, VHS, VHS two, and VHS three. You can also play around with those play around with the noise settings the blur and all of them have really cool overlays that you can play around with too now the main thing that i'm going to be showing you guys how to do when it comes to color grading your videos on pixart is how to play around with color what you're going to want to do is go into adjust first off you can play around with the brightness the contrast the saturation a little bit and then we're going to go into hsl this is going to be your biggest color grading friend okay essentially what this does is this is going to help you manipulate all of your colors and make your videos look less flat if you move the toggle to the right it'll intensify the color of the hue and make it more orange and if you move it to the left it'll make the color more pink so for example for the yellow one i'm going to make the saturation of the yellow color closer to white versus yellow so that it'll make my teeth whiter life hack uh if you want to make your teeth brighter in videos Look, you didn't hear it from me, girl, but that's all I'm gonna say. Basically, what that does is that makes the yellow part of the video less stronger and the white more prominent. So your teeth are gonna be looking shiny and pearly white, which I think we all want, right? The second video I'm going to be showing you guys, I just shot this on my iPhone, simple as that. And I want to emphasize the sunset in this video, which I feel like you can't really see. I feel like the colors are a little bit dull in this. We're going to go into HSL again. I'm going to bump up the turquoise hue and the saturation of that as well. I'm also going to do the same with the red colors to make the sun hiding behind the colors pop out a little bit. I'm also going to pop on a filter, specifically the Film 2 filter, which is one of my favorites, just so that the gray clouds in the background are as obvious. This way, I feel like you can see the beautiful view and it looks like it was shot on a film camera which y'all know i already love and this next life hack for color grading your videos is for all of my lazy girls raise your hand girl it's okay as you can see the filter i have on from the original tiktok is a little too bright for my personal liking i just want to turn her down a little bit but maybe you're lazy maybe you don't want to just the brightness and the contrast and the this and the that all you have to do is go into effects and slap on a filter and call it a day girl that's it i'm gonna put on natural one as you can see it just tones down the brightness by a little bit and it's perfect boom she's looking cute you can also add a black and white filter which if you're feeling a little bit moody if you want to actually put this on actual film footage you can do that we have a wide range of different black and white filters too depending on your liking which like i didn't even know there were different types of black and white filters so i mean depending on your vibe girl you do you but if you want to create a really melancholy sad scene maybe you want to go into the black and white video filters and choose one of those and i found this filter under colors it's called red it kind of gives you that like papery tumbler look which is really in right now because i know we're going back into 2014. I love this. I'm going to be using this on all of my videos from now on. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to click the subscribe button. We upload new videos every single Monday. And I know you guys want to see my face again, so just do it. And make sure you're following us on all of our other social media accounts linked in our description box below. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!